FDA's MedWatch program allows healthcare professionals and consumers to report to the FDA serious problems with the medical products they prescribe, dispense, or use. These reports, along with follow-up investigations, can help to identify important safety concerns. Take the example of the antibiotic Zyvox. Within the first six months of Zyvox's marketing, FDA began getting MedWatch reports of myelosuppression from clinicians who suspected that the drug might be responsible. After investigating the problem, we worked with the manufacturer to change the Zyvox labeling to warn about the potential for myelosuppression. Sometimes MedWatch reports highlight errors in prescribing or administering medications. For example, FDA received reports of patient injuries due to name confusion between Lanoxin, a heart medication, and what used to be called Lavoxin, which is a thyroid medication. As a result, FDA asked the manufacturer to change the name of Lavoxin, and now it's known as Lavoxyl, which is less likely to be confused with Lanoxin. The MedWatch system can also help detect problems with medical products other than drugs. For example, FDA received two reports of pneumococcal eye infections in patients who'd received corneal transplants. An FDA inspection identified numerous manufacturing problems, which led the company to recall the implants. Of course, MedWatch reports by themselves can't usually establish a causal relationship between an adverse event and a medical product. It may take a formal epidemiologic study to do that. Still, MedWatch reports are vital in making sure that medical products are safe because they provide a rapid signal to the FDA that problems may be occurring. It's important to keep the MedWatch system working, and we can't do that without your help. Here are the kinds of reports we need from you. First of all, we're asking that you report any serious adverse event that might be associated with a drug or a biologic, a medical device, or a dietary supplement. And by serious, we mean fatalities, hospitalizations, and medically significant events. We're especially interested in serious adverse events that aren't listed in the product labeling. Secondly, report therapeutic failures, cases where the drug or device failed to work as it should. For example, let us know if a patient has to switch from one brand of a drug to another because the original one was ineffective. Third, tell us about cases of use errors with medications or devices, including situations where the error may have been due to poor communication or to ambiguities in product names or directions for use or packaging. And finally, we'd like to know about product quality issues, such as suspected counterfeit products, defective components, potential contamination, device malfunctions, and poor packaging. We encourage you to report these problems to MedWatch, even if you're not sure that the product was the cause. It's easy to report by internet, phone, fax, or mail, and you'll find more complete information on what to report and how to report on our website. Safety TV is brought to you by safetyissues.com. Life has no reset button. Think, think safety. safety.